Hello and welcome to Water Dog Photography. I'm Brooke Peterson. Today I'm going to show you how to crop an image and also resize the image. So it is a two-step process both in Lightroom and in Photoshop so I will be showing you both of those. Um, when you open an image in Lightroom you're going to need to go to the develop module and in the develop module at the top right hand corner click on the square that looks like a little grid up here. When you click on that square you'll see uh, an overlay come up. Um, it, it can be different than this. It'll be whatever you have set. Mine is set as a default for the rule of thirds. So this, this comes up. Over in the right hand column under crop and straighten there's a word that says original. If you click on that original this brings a drop down box of different sizes. I need to crop say to um, 11 by 14. That's the size that I want to use. So I'm going to cl click on that and it's going to bring the box down to that size. So my image is a little bit larger than that size. Now all I am doing is, is cropping the image to this aspect ratio. That doesn't necessarily mean that it will be 11 by 14. It just means that it's the aspect ratio of 11 by 14. So I will go ahead and, and crop to that size and then click done. And now the image is cropped to that size but when I export this image I need it to actually be 11 by 14. So I will click on the library module and export on the left hand side. And on the left hand side um, when this comes up I, I use a, a preset that I've got set called gallery. It doesn't matter what you use. Um, but this box over here uh, in, the, in the middle is the one that you're going to look at. So I usually set mine choose folder later so that I can choose which folder that this image is going to go into later. Um, I can kind of ignore these other boxes because what I want to get down to is image sizing. So on the image sizing box you, you may need to click the arrow to make sure that it's open. If, it, if it's closed like that go ahead and click the arrow and click on the box that says resize to fit. And then your width and height, you can change the width and height to inches or centimeters or pixels or whatever you want. But in my case, I want the width to be 11 inches and I want the height to be 14 inches. And I want a high resolution on this. I want a resolution of 320 and that's 320 pixels per inch. So this is the setting that I need on the image sizing to get an 11 by 14 um, image that is cropped to 11 by 14. So this is the second step of that process. And then um, I, I'm going to ignore the other boxes I have for now but you can you can fill those in if you want to watermark or, or whatever else you want to do with it. And I'm going to, to click on export. Now for me um, it asks where I want it to go and uh, let's just say I want it to go into My Photos 2018. You can choose where you want that to go. And it will export that. Now that image is exported in that folder that I just put it in and it is an 11 by 14 image at an 11 by 14 uh, aspect ratio. So I've done two, two things to get it there. You can also do this in Photoshop and I'm going to show you how to do that now. This image in Photoshop you're going to do the same process. You're going to go to the Crop tool and you want to crop it to 11 by 14. So you'll have to um, go up into the the uh, drop down box here uh, to get the size. Um, my 11 by 14 I will need to do a new crop preset so if it's not up there um, it's, I don't want to name it one to one. I'm going to name it 11 by 14 and then in here I'm going to put in 11 at the top of this box so it's 11 inches wide. Actually it's 14 inches wide because this is a, a horizontal. 14 inches wide by 11 inches high. Okay and then I'm going to click on the the um, check mark. And now it has cropped that image to 11 by 14 because that's the aspect ratio that I've told it to crop to. But you'll find that that image isn't necessarily 11 by 14 images, I, um, inches. You can go up here and click on image and go down to image size. Click on image size and it'll actually tell you how big this image is. So this image is actually 20 inches wide by 16 inches high which is an aspect ratio of 11 by 14. But I want it 11 by 14 so I'm going to change the width to 14 inches. So in this box it says width put in 14 inches 
and then this box that it, it automatically chose um, because of that aspect ratio almost 11 uh, 10.999 so almost 11 so 14 11 by 14 and I want that resolution again to be 320 and then just click OK so now this image is an 11 by 14 image cropped to the aspect ratio of 11 by 14 and that's how you do it in Photoshop uh, you you have to go to image size to make sure that the size is actually an 11 by 14 not just cropped to the size 11 by 14 and that's all there is to it